Alrighty, as promised, I got a little bonus here where I'm going to show you how to configure Adobe Media Encoder to automatically upload to your favorite social channels like Twitter, Facebook, Vimeo, YouTube, etc. Alright, so you don't have to go to all these different websites and select your file, upload it, write new messages. Adobe Media Encoder is going to automate all that for you. It's pretty cool. So over here in Animate, with the same file open, let's go to Export Video. I'm going to use the same settings, except here I'm just going to create a new MOV file and I'm going to put Twitter on it like that so I know which one I'm dealing with. I'm going to hit save and again I want to make sure that I'm converting video in Adobe Media Encoder. I'll hit export and so Adobe Media Encoder should open up. We'll see the same screen as we saw before. But What I want to show you is that if I click on the format what happens is Adobe Media Encoder opens up another window it allows us to trim the start and end points if we want, and we can configure a whole bunch of different settings and customize them about the effects, video, audio, all this sort of stuff. But I want to show you that we have this Publish tab here. Now, with the resolution I have currently, um, you can't really see what I want to show you, all right? I have to scroll through this long window here. So I'm just going to minimize the export settings, and then now I'll show you that under Publish, that we have all of these different uh, social channels that we can export to, um, Vimeo, Twitter, YouTube. But let's just focus on Twitter here. You may see this list uh, compressed initially. So here's Twitter. We're gonna click on it and we'll open it up. And I'm not logged into my Twitter account now. So through Adobe Media Encoder, I'm gonna log in and it's going to ask me to authorize my application. So I'm going to use the username of animated ads or animate dads, which is a little weird. And then my password is going to be pancakes. Ooh, oops, I shouldn't have said that. And I'm going to log in and it says, now we authorize this to know everything about you and your privacy is completely ruined, blah, 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 blah. Hit authorize app. And then now we're good. Adobe Media Encoder recognizes the animated ads account. And I'm just going to say test two. Um, we'll just call this direct publish. Yay. And then we're just going to now hit OK. So watch this. We now have this video in our queue. We still need to hit play. Adobe Animate does its thing. And let's just wait a few moments. And you'll see that this link here pops up. So directly from Adobe Media Encoder, I can click on that link and it's gonna take me to my Twitter page and it's going to show me my latest tweet. All right, so there we have test two and everything's working perfectly. Isn't that awesome? Yes, it is. So if you're ever doing some huge media campaigns and you wanna post on multiple channels, you can do it with just literally a click of a button. Awesome. Normal daddy.